The CSAT program is specific to anyone that's 55 and older, but they have to be unemployed and not work ready. And that is our goal to get them work ready. That's why we do the training and assessments in order to be successful that they can go out to the workforce and do that special job they want to do. Uh, well, in another life, I was a corporate meeting planner. I did meetings and conventions all over the world for about 30 years. I got in some legal trouble. I did 13 and a half years in prison. When I got out, um, I was in my 60s and uh, couldn't find a job, couldn't find a place to live, and I found uh, Sarah. They not only helped me to find the training that I needed to get back on my feet, to find the job that I wanted, which, which I have, but they offered me uh, emotional assistance, mental assistance, uh, and guidance to where I could regain the confidence that I had lost in myself and my abilities. The place that I work now, Reentry First Stop of Tarrant County, it was my host agency through Sarah, and now I work for them full time. The host organization that they sent me to it was a perfect fit. There are what we call our host agencies. They're the ones that take care of our trainees. It's a great partnership. One of the ladies came and she trained uh, under me as a peer support. And so she was just really, really good with the people. And she's gone on and she is a peer support and case manager with MHMR now. We teach them the basic computer digital skills that they need for, for an office environment. We also teach them how to use the fax machine, the scanner, how to attach any files to the emails, how to send emails as well. You go from installing air conditioning for 22 years, you come back here and tell them something off the wall, well, you know, I want to work with computers. You know, from the find a spot that quick, I was impressed with it. Because you've been to the penitentiary, they're not looking at you, looking down on you. They're just trying to help you move forward from there. It was new learning again to do a resume and to do a job search. It was hard. Since I've been with CSEP, it made me feel like I can still go out there and do a good job being a receptionist. We had participants that have no place to stay. They would come into the program, now they got an apartment, <laughs> and, they, and it's wonderful. I'm a veteran, and through a referral that the director of this local office gave me, I was able to gain housing into a, a veteran's house, which I was at for 10 months. Sarah helped me tremendously, not just to find a job, but to help me find a place to stay and to transition back into the world. Me and MJ are, are roommates. I mean, we went from being in a halfway house to be a Patriot house to transitional housing. We're fixed to get a three bedroom. So we're moving up as we are. That wouldn't happen without Sarah. That's what CSAP is all about.